Hey beauties, good afternoon or good evening. Why am I saying afternoon? Good evening to you. Beautiful people, you know, something is a bit strange. I've been noticing it. I don't know if I'm the only one. Um, I noticed that three persons so far have moved over from the People's National Party to the Jamaica Labour Party. I remember one, was it last evening or the evening before, saying it's worse over there. You don't know what is happening down there. And then another, you know, lady, I don't remember her name. She recently, she was at the um, GLP's conference speaking, you know. And then the same gentleman who was saying it's bad down there, as in, in, in terms of the People's National Party, was saying that when he put on the green, he realized, like him said, why didn't he put it on longer? And he realized he looks better. I know that was just, you know, political talk and whatnot. But I'm very much concerned now, you know. Um, and as Jamaicans, we should be, you know, because you don't want a situation where our race is being run and only one horse is in the race. You know, um, as I said, I'm not politi politically aligned to any party in spite of what some people may think. Like some people, I don't think they process things properly. For example, I spoke about the, um, they don't process it with emotional intelligence or even intelligence quotient. Um, I spoke about the dress code by and large for the a specific occasion. And people were saying that the PNPs, when they have their people dressed like that, I have, I didn't, if they did, I didn't see it, you know? And if, if you listen to my post, it was general. I was saying, once you have a professional meeting, that you should dress for the occasion. If, you have, if you're going to a party, then your outfit that you had on that was inappropriate for that meeting may just be appropriate for the party, but not for that meeting, you know. And anyway, I realize that there are some people, it seems as if when reasoning ability was, is being offered on a platter, the platter was just, you know, boxed out of the hand, unfortunately. But I'm concerned because three people thus far Three in you know um moved over from the People's National Party over to the Jamaica Labour Party. I know that a number of the the masses or the masses rather in Jamaica have been complaining about the governance of our country not being manned you know we are not being manned properly we're not being governed properly and so on. However, you know now to see these three people moving over from the People's National Party who is presently in opposition over into the one who is in current. Uh, governance right now the Jamaica Labour Party and it certainly is a cause for concern because what it will do once you know the, ch the chain is as strong as, as its weakest link you know and uh, they already lost a number of people when they you know quite a few um, people over that side had lost their I, I don't know what you call it being MPs you know they had lost some barely scraped through and when you find that three people, you know, leaving that side, it weakens the opposition. When the opposition is weakened, it um, almost strengthens a sense of autonomy. I'm not saying that we, the, um, the GLP has autonomy, but it strengthens a sense, an air of autonomy that may be lurking in the bushes, which is never, ever good governance for a country, you must always have a strong opposition so that any little misfit, any anomaly that is off, you know, anything that seems like a misappropriation or anything that seems like injustice or some sort of a malady or some sort of a decadence, something that is not right, you need the opposition to get on board and to see it, highlight it, deal with the, the matter immediately, instantaneously, even. So when three people move away and walk away and go over to the other side, it speaks volume. It means that Jamaica, I don't know where, what to say we're in. We're more, I can't even say we're submerged. I cannot even say that we're submerged. We are in serious problems. So I was frightened when, you know, the news came on and I noticed the woman talking I think her name is a Miss Phillips or something like that. And I'm like, what? You know, and, uh, you know, the news highlighted that she had issues with, you know, since a change over in, um, was it 2020 when Mark Golden came over? 
whenever he had come over, you know, whatever year he had come over, you know, um, listen, <laughs> you see, one of the, one of the maladies we face in life is sometimes we wear our feelings on our sleeves, on our shoulders. In other words, I don't believe in sweeping cockroaches under a carpet, but I be also believe in ensure that you get the cockroaches in, if you're unable to get it outside immediately, you find a better way than sweeping it under the mat until you're able to get the cockroach outside properly disposed of the dead cockroaches because it will come back and haunt you at an inopportune time. So whatever issues you guys having and you're, if you're unable to control it and this is um within just leading this little party, can you imagine if you're given the country to run, what will happen? It speaks volumes. Jamaican, the Jamaicans by and large are having an issue with the present governing party and so on and now yet three people from the people's national party have left and gone over to the one that seems to be trouble so is it i can't say no better herring no better barrel is it the lesser of the two evils that they gone over to is it the lesser of the two evils so to speak and that's a quotation so i don't want nobody to come and say i'm calling anybody evil please i'm not saying that it is a quotation please all right but it is something, it's a cause for concern. I want people to think critically, think deeply and look, have some insight into what is happening. Because it cannot be good for our country. We're already in a lot of difficulties financially, spiritually, mentally, psychologically, educationally. And now I'm seeing three people moving from, you know, I heard the man saying it and I was I said, hmm, that's strange. And another man before in fairly recent time, I know this um, woman has gone over to the GLP. And I know they're going to um, um, capitalize on that. Obviously, you know, it's political uh, marketing. Obviously, they're going to capitalize. So they're going to make the three of them speak and speak that they, you know, it's not, it wasn't a bed of roses over there. It wasn't good over there. And you know how the usual talk is, you know, and that's why the man get up and saying, if he had known that he would have looked this good in green, he would have worn it all, um earlier took up the bell and, and i'm saying wow no sir i can imagine i'm so sorry i wish i had gone to see the whole thing in in full flight i wish i had gone i didn't know about it by the time i knew about it i mean i would not have been prepared to say let me go and see what is going on what is happening to see all the hullabaloo sometimes you have to sit there you have to dead in and see what is going on you have to be on the ground the bible said be wise it says to be wise as a serpent Harmless as a dove. A lot of people are not wise. You know, they only hear things on the periphery. They don't look deeply. You know, the emotional intelligence is not there. You know, the critical thinking skills isn't there. Sometimes even the intelligence quotient, like, you know, a sense of, I don't want to use that D word. It's not a good word to use. But beautiful people, it is a cause for concern. You may think it is usual, you know, people bring up some old time. Oh, people from this side, well, no, not like that. Not when a country has some difficulties and challenges with the present ruling party. And then this, the, the one that is in opposition is out, you know, is out um, of, uh, it's not in present government, govern, um, not present leading. And three of the people left to go over to the one that is, that somewhat, People may say it has a defect. No, sir. So are you saying that's the lesser of the two evils? Please note it's a quotation. That it's, it's better to be over the JLP side. Are we saying that? I'm asking a question, not alluding to anything. I'm asking a question. Are you saying it is better to be over to the, over the JLP side than to be over PNP? I don't know because... If the PNP barely has anyone, if you notice when you're looking at parliament and you look on one side and you look over the other side, you just have to shake your head. And then three, left, PNP, boy, I tell you. But I'm not surprised, you know. I'm not surprised. One thing I'm going to tell you guys, you reap what you sow. I never liked how the, um, the demitting of office for the, for the um, very esteemed Portia Simpson Miller came i hope you guys think on what i've just said over the people's national party i never liked it guys follow me on tiktok subscribe to my youtube channel share this message